To complete this challenge, you will need a placemat, a square paper, your name on that paper, a cup of water, a paintbrush, and a paper towel. Should you choose to accept, your mission will be to use only the three primary colors to mix all 12 colors on the color wheel. You only have today one class to complete this mission. You will begin by painting the primary colors first. Be sure to space them out equally and leave space for the secondary and tertiary colors in between. It does not have to be beautiful, but it can be. So you might want to think a little bit about the shapes and spaces you want to fill with each of your color groups. It's important to wash and dry your brush in between each color so that we don't mix the colors in the palette. They have to stay pure so that we can mix all of our different color groups. Once you paint your three primary colors, you'll move on to your secondary color groups, orange, green, and violet. For each of these colors, you're gonna start with the lighter color first, putting that onto your paper and then mixing the darker color into it in little increments. The darker color is dominant, so you have to make sure to use less of that color and slowly add it because once you've added it, you cannot take it out, but you can always add a little more. If you're not sure if your color is quite right, pick up the color wheel and compare it to the color that you've mixed. Now I'm moving on to orange, always starting with the lighter color first, so I'm starting with my yellow, and then I'll add little bits of red. Hold on, my water's too dirty, I'll be right back. Make sure to get fresh water if your water gets really muddy because it will make your colors look muddy too. Now I'm adding in tiny bits of red until it becomes the perfect balance to make our orange. Let's check in with the color wheel to see how we're looking. I think it looks good, so now I'm gonna move on to my green. When mixing, it's important to wash my brush before going into the next color that I need so I don't contaminate it. So I washed my brush really well before I got blue onto it to mix into my yellow. I have successfully mixed my secondary colors, violet, orange, and green. Now I'll begin my final color group, which we call intermediate or tertiary. These are all our in-between colors, yellow, green, yellow, orange, red orange, red violet, blue violet, and blue green. Make sure you're washing and drying your brush in between, dunking it in each color, and check in with the color wheel to make sure it's as close as it can be to the color on the reference. Mine is a little messy, but I have successfully completed the one day color wheel challenge. I have my primary colors, my secondary colors, and all of my tertiary or intermediate colors. Should receive full points because I managed to not contaminate the primary colors and I completed all 12 colors on the color wheel. So now you can take a picture and submit it to Schoology.